the edge of the universe, Peter Quill? Well, yeah, because it is. So, uh, this is the thing you had to do? Come to the observation deck to look at the rift? No. I came to honor the memory of my family. They died without meaning. Or honor. I think I know what you mean, man. My mom, when the, uh, Shatara came. She also died for no reason. They just... just shot her. But at least she's in a better place now. Right? In Katathian religion, we believe that in order to reach Ultaf, one must lead a life filled with purpose. Failure to do so results in banishment to Sarduth. Our families have been cast out of paradise, Peter Quill, and into nothing. Whoa, whoa, wait. Wherever my mom is, it's not out there, okay? She was a good person. How do you know? Because I just know, all right? If she's anywhere, it's in heaven. She doesn't just deserve to... ...stop being. If you do not mind, Peter Quill, I would like to be left alone now. Oh, yeah. Sure, man, no problem. I'll catch you back at the ship. I hope Cosmo's in the office. Bridge closed. Go away. Doesn't look closed. Sister, nowhere security. Super official. Go out the way, Ali, Ali. I really need to see Cosmo. Cosmo, not in Dower. He out there, Star Lord, in Ali. Wait, how did you know my name? Oh, I end up in Cosmo prison. You choose. Cosmo! You in here? Cosmo! Sure. Not weird at all. Cosmo is definitely somewhere in this maze of rotting brain matter. Okay, just gotta find Cosmo, then I can deal with the team. Peter, there's something out there, but I won't tell you what it is, because I think being distant makes me mysterious.
Cosmo? That you? Oh, I hate mazes. Especially stinking brain mazes. Okay, dude. Deep breath. Deep breath. I am Groot. Stop being so nice to him, brown grumble hiss. Fuck! I give myself a heart attack. Cosmo! Cosmo! What we got here. Watch it, Star Lord. And what's a filthy scut stained Terran doing out here, Rawson? Hiding's what I think, Garrick. My. Terrans always be hiding. Cause everybody knows Terrans are scrawny. And good for eating. Uh, if you're into that, we might be into that. Except for the bounty. Hey, guys, wouldn't happen to know where Cosmo's office is, would you? I get the distinct feeling that you're looking for someone of the Earth persuasion. <laughs> I get it, man. I get it. Us Earthers, we all look the same. It's not like you guys who very clearly look different. Get to the point, Terran. The point is, is I can help you find who you're actually looking for. Terrans do all look the same. Except this Terran's got a word on his back. Just like the bounty says. What's that word on your back say? Uh, I heart nowhere. Hmm. Well, maybe it says Star Lord. Either way, get him! We've been hired to clobber some Terran with words on his jacket. Uh, 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 lots of people have jackets. Yeah, but you're the one the lady wanted. So hurry up and die. Wait, the lady ace want him alive? Dang. <laughs> uh, 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 lady H, whatever Lady Hailbender's paying you, I'll double it. No dice. You don't cross Lady H. Uh, uh, triple. Oh, uh, I'll triple it. Yeah, now, Ron. Anybody think to bring refreshments? You gonna shut up already? It's boot point time. Did we just talk about this? Scrawny little Terran is scared. Get crushed, Terran. Okay, okay, okay. Yep, yeah, yeah, time out. <sighs> Woo! Heart is pumping. <laughs> Guys, it's very clear that we're evenly matched. Ha! Here. No, we ain't. 
We're completely invincible. Oh, well, that sucks, but we're all professionals here, right? Right? Maybe we can work something out. <laughs> 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 Peter! Shoot now! We need to keep them separated! <laughs> Draw them apart before shooting, Peter! <laughs> Sick. It's about these zombies that invade Earth, and then it's a I knew you wouldn't wait. Do you know what a birthright is, Peter? It's something that's a part of you. Like your name. Before your father returned to space, 
Ugh, Mom. I know it sounds crazy and that you've never believed me, but something has changed. And now more than ever, you need to trust me. And maybe this will help. Wow. Easy there, cowboy. These belong to your father. I used to think he left these for our protection. But they might as well be paperweights. Still, if they're enough to convince you of who he really was, then maybe they're protection enough. Protection from what? Your father wasn't just from another planet, Peter. He was... He was important. And important men have enemies. What sort of enemies? I'm not sure exactly. His people were at war. And he knew that if he stayed with us, the war would follow him to Earth. So he made the hard choice. He gave up this life for the sake of his people. Your father left to protect us. And for 13 years it worked. But now something's coming. I know we're being watched. Mom, if you really want to play a game that bad, you could have just said so. I hope I'm wrong, Peter. I really do. But being the son of a king on any planet means that you are going to have a target on your back for the rest of your life. And you're plenty brave. But you're gonna have to be smart, too. Things may get messy. I'm gonna let Kubrick out. I'll be right back. failed your mission, miserably. Peter Quill, these lackluster bounty hunters claim Lady Hellbender hired them to kill us. Hey, we're no slouches. We're part of the League now. No, no, no. You said yourself she'd hunt us to the end of the universe. I had hoped she'd send a monster. 
Not these two. We would have murderized you. But don't worry. There's more coming. Uh, did you hear that, Peter Quill? A silver lining. Yeah, that's great, Drax. Won't be long in these clabber traps. Not us. Mm -mm. Friends will be breaking us out soon. Huh? Real soon. Then you'll wish we did kill. Be silent. Nice that you finally showed up. Would have been even nicer if you didn't abandon me in the first place. I never left. One minute we're having a great time and the next... Wait a second, did you use me as bait? Huh. Well, your plan worked a little too well seeing how we're in jail now. We're all in prisons of our own making, Peter. <laughs>